Hey everyone, welcome back to BDG Reviews and night three of uh, 31 Days of Horror. What I watched tonight was uh, Incarnate. This is starring um, Aaron Eckert. You know, um, I'm kind of drawing a blank. I know he's been in a lot of stuff. He was in um, Dark Knight. But other than that, I can't really think of anything else he was in. Um... There's actually a WWE Studios and a Bloomhouse um, kind of production, if you will, if that's right. Yeah, yeah. I am Global, Bloomhouse, and WWE Studios. Um, essentially, what you got here is your basic possession movie with a twist. And that twist is, it's not focusing on, excuse me, not focusing on, like, the whole religion side really i mean that's something that um possession movies have always done they always fall back on you know the the catholic religious exorcism rites and everything um where this is, goes a bit of a different way you essentially you got this guy aaron eckert he's uh i guess you could call him an exorcist but he calls it like a he, he evicts them he just kind of reckons that like uh demons that possess people are just kind of like um parasites essentially and um he can like go into the person's mind and like essentially wake them up from being possessed and kick out the demon um it, it was pretty neat i gotta admit i i was quite i was quite pleased with it um now there there are some like plot holes and everything it's not a perfect movie by any stretch of the imagination but it's a good different type of like exorcism flick you know um it, it's just kind of neat really you know i, I and I, I just like that tagline right there faith has failed us you know it's 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 one of those things i always think would, would be kind of neat when you do like an exorcism movie I think it would be so cool if you were to just have one where, like, they, they bring in, like, the Catholic priest. He does the exorcism, and it doesn't work, and he's just kind of like, yeah, this isn't, um, your typical thing. You gotta go, you gotta try something else, because this, this isn't working. You know, this is something that could have, could have worked with that particular type of plot line. And it, it sort of has it, I mean, you know... Like, priests tried to exercise him and it just didn't really work, something like that. But, all in all, it was a pretty solid movie. I'm giving it a 7 out of 10. I actually enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty good. Um, the acting was pretty good. And, um, I don't really even know what to say about effects. Because, really, there's not that many. You know, there's, like, a digital, like, demon at one point. Kind of, like, looking digital demon. Um, but it's, it's honestly, it's just in passing. It's for, like, literally about maybe, like, 45 seconds. That's it. And, um, it doesn't really matter. The rest is done. You know, there, there's a few things, like, people flying in the air and everything. And... It, it's got some neat scenes, and like I said, 7 out of 10. Uh, I'll leave the trailer down below. If you like what you see, give it a shot. It's it's pretty cheap. You can get this for under 10 bucks easily. Um, yeah, so incarnate, 7 out of 10. Give it a shot. That's it for now. See you next time.